Jonathan. John. Well, now, voters have been voting at the polls in local and regional elections across the country today, but the process has not all gone smoothly. Many residents arriving to vote this morning at Barnet in North London were turned away from polling stations after a mix-up led to officials having incomplete lists of electors. The chief rabbi and his wife were among those asked to come back later while the council tried to sort out the problems. Simon Brown reports. Although the sun was out for election day, a shadow was cast over North London as the polls opened. The lady looked through the register and said, you're not on the register. And I said, well, I'm registered to vote. And she said, do you have your polling card? I said, no, I don't have my polling card. It says you don't need to bring it. And then she said, well, unfortunately, you're not going to be able to vote. Um, and then another lady came over and said, there's been an error with the register. So they've been given the incorrect register. And if you're not on the register, you cannot vote. And then I, I kind of stood there in a bit of disbelief and decided that I might as well get to work instead of stand and argue. But I just, I, yeah, I just left. 25-year-old Shane Bunsey was not the only one who was prevented from voting across this borough of over 300,000 residents, many hoping to vote, were turned away due to a mistake with the electoral registration list held at stations here. Now, the London borough of Barnet was already pretty significant. In terms of population, it's one of London's biggest boroughs, which means turnout here really does matter. Now, in response to the problems, one of the candidates for the mayoralty has already lodged an official complaint. And one candidate for the Assembly suggested there could even be a legal challenge if the election is close. The council said... We're advising people who were unable to vote this morning to return again before the polling stations close, if at all possible. We apologise for the problems voters have experienced. The council said residents could vote by an emergency proxy, meaning someone else could vote on their behalf, but only if an online application was made before 5pm. People who left, um, some of them might not be able to get back for 10 o'clock tonight. Uh, I, I hear now, um, this afternoon, they're doing an emergency proxy thing. Uh, but you have to be online to register. What if some people don't work near computers? You know, some people still work with their hands. You know, I'm one of them. What if we don't work near computers? What if we can't get online and get that proxy done? We don't know how many were stopped from voting. But if the turnout is unusually low in a very tight election, today's fiasco could become a major dispute. Well, the local election...